everybody, it's Mama J. Inspector. We are here with a different kind of video. <laughs> Um, we actually went to this really great place. Uh, it was actually recommended from Michael and Faith over at Pops with Purpose. So I'm sure you've seen their videos. We took a field trip and we went to Band for Arms. Um, it's about 20 minutes from us, I think. Uh, yeah, about 20 minutes. About 20 minutes, not traffic. too far. Yeah, not too far. So we went ahead and headed up there the other night and... Um, we wanted to check it out, and we actually really enjoyed ourselves. I think we were there, what, an hour, hour and a half? Yeah, something like that. The owner, Nick, is an amazing guy. We talked to him quite a bit. Um, we did film some while we were there, so we will uh, show you some of that footage throughout this video. Uh, he has grab bags. He has uh, these great bands that are made out of uh, military uniforms. Um uh, all kinds of things. It was a very fun and interesting place to go to. We will definitely be going back. They also take donations, uh, Pops for Patients. So on our next trip there, we will be taking some to donate. Um, and while we were there, we bought 10 mystery bags. Yeah. Yeah, we bought 10 mystery bags, uh, seven of the bands and um this is what we bought okay so this is what we got um some of these came out of the mystery bags yep. some of these were wins from the mystery bags and um if you got a common in a mystery bag you got to pick another common we also ended up with uh get um an exclusive for up to 25 dollars. i think we ended up with two of those, two of those. we got one for 20 dollars and I also got one that said you win two times Captain America, which were these two here. And also a uh, win six times common pop. Oh, yeah. And we got to win six common pops. Um, so, I mean, it's an outstanding place. As you can see, we're going to kind of go over all the pops that we did end up with really quick. You will see us in the videos that uh, we cut into this that... Um, us opening the mystery bags, what we got, things like that. We filmed some things. Also, he has a little shrine to Stan Lee because he said he had done some work with Stan Lee, right? Yeah. He said they he made did a, a band work. together and some other stuff. Yeah. Um, you know, so I know that there will be some photos of that included throughout the video. Um, but we're going to just kind of go over some of these pops we got. And we got so many. I literally... Did not expect to get this many. <laughs> no. um, that was, you know, not what we intended to do. But like I said, we got up there. The mystery bags were really fun to open. Um, there was a, was it 15% off the mystery bags? Something uh, like that. 25 off those, 15 off the wristbands, is it? No, I think it was 15 off the mystery bags. Um no, it was 25 off the mystery bags, was 15 it? off the bands. Yeah. Oh, okay. You know, so there was a special going on because it was the day before Halloween that we did go. So uh, we're going to go over, like I said, a few things here. Um, I got this one to go in my diamond collection. We actually picked this out with one of our uh, $25 exclusive or below. Uh, there was a slight difference, and I did go ahead and pay that difference, but I got a really, really awesome pop. Um, you want to pick one out? Yeah, with our about? other $25 uh, exclusive, we got the Diamond Genie. There's a the story Latin. behind that pot, though. That uh, yeah, so apparently when he was opening up the shop, this was the very first Diamond Pop that he got for the shop, which is really cool. Yeah, so it was really awesome to be able to get that pop. Um, and like I said, he was a great guy. We talked to him a lot we filmed some we looked around yeah it was funny because in there he has like disney songs playing and it's playing one of the genie songs i said it'd be kind of cool if they had a genie pop and that disney songs are why we'll have to cut out the the audio the audio on the yeah. video that we show um and then we i got the two times captain america so i got this one i mean literally got both of these for the price of one mystery bag 
Mine's so, a Kohl's exclusive. They're the exact same. They're just from different locations. These are really cool. Okay. Um, this one was one of the comments that was picked out. When I won six comments, I picked this one. Let's see if we can remember what six. This one. Uh, we got the Ultra Instinct Goku one. I got the Wonder Woman one. Because I did not have this. And everybody that knows me knows I'm always on a hunt for a Wonder Woman. We got the Venomized Hulk one. Which is awesome because we do only have, I think, now two of the first wave. Yes. Okay. I also got Wolverine because everybody knows I love Wolverine. That's a really cool pop. Uh, we also got uh, Jareth. I picked that pop, but um, that is not how I asked him to take it off the shelf. I said, hey, can you grab me the David Bowie pop? And he's like, what? I said the David Bowie pop, you know, because I'm old. This is Ziggy Stardust to me, um, which is David Bowie. I know this is for the movie Labyrinth, but it's kind of like a win-win, you know. You get two for one. Um, what else did we pick? Uh, this one was also Oh, that was also there. Harley Quinn. Yeah, I thought that was a really cool Harley Quinn, and I do like DC, so she fits into that one. Um, I think that's so six. that's the six. Yeah, and then we opened a bag and I got Thor, which he was a common. So we got to pick another common. Do you remember which common we picked? Um, um had to be something we wanted. I'm not even sure which common we picked. Oh, wait, Goku. That one, right? No, we did that with the six. Oh, well, I have six here. So somewhere along the lines, we miscounted them. Yeah. So this one actually um, was these six that we showed off, and this one were the comments that we all linked together. Um, Inside one of the bags, you got that I got one. the Maui with the. Sh so he got this one out of a bag, which um, I mean, it is Deadpool, right? Yeah, so. it's just like a different version of Deadpool. Yeah. Uh, what else did we get? Uh, we got the. Glow in the dark, black panther. He came in one of the bags. He was like the last bag. He's actually an exclusive. Like I noticed he doesn't have an exclusive sticker on him, but I know he was only available at two locations. I want to say Walmart, and I don't remember the other one, but he doesn't have a sticker on him. Um, and then the final one, right? Well, no, I also got oh, Minnie. Yeah. Minnie. Minnie was one of the ones I traded in because she was a diamond, so I used one of our wins on this one um, to add her to my collection. I really love these diamond pops, and I only have a few, and now I have a few more. <laughs> and then the last and one you the got there. the last one is the uh, glow-in-the-dark Deku. He just started watching um, My Hero Academia, so he just started... He added that to our collection of what we're collecting. And you have what? That's like your fifth one or sixth um, one? Like fifth or sixth, yeah. Yeah, so those are brand new for us. He just started collecting those. But we went, we bought ten mystery boxes. Um, six of the boxes had pops in them. Four of the boxes had certificates in them. Some had pops and certificates. Um, it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. We, yeah. um you know, we did that, and then on top of that, let's move these pops so we can show them these awesome, awesome um, bands that we got at the store while we were there. Okay. Okay? Okay, so now we're going to show you these awesome, awesome bands that we got. We ended up with seven of them. They did have a special, buy three, but at the end, I ran across one that I bought as a gift for somebody. I'm sure once they see it, they'll know it's for them. Um, so we went and we picked out different ones and, um, they each come with a little card of info. Yeah. Um, so which one would you like to show first? Um, let's go ahead and show the Batman one. And let him know what the paper says and show him the band. You want to show the, I read the card? The band is really awesome. So, and you just strap them around your wrist. 
And like I said, they are made out of um, donated military uniforms. So this one is from Mr. Mendoza, owner B4A, was in the U.S. Navy from the city of Orange in California, served for 10 years, hobbies and interests, saving my life. And then uh, let's just show them the cards so you can kind of see. So each band comes with one of these and it gives you some information about the band, which is quite awesome. Um, the next one that we chose, I don't have to say it again, do I? Because if you know me, you know I'm always on the hunt <laughs> for a Wonder Justin Woman. Bieber. Oh, wait. For a Wonder Woman. So this one, there's the military uniform that was donated and the Wonder Woman. So this one I'm personally keeping from my collection. And this one is from Mr. Travis Aaron Wade. U.S. Marine Corps from Los Angeles, California, four years served, artist, animal stewardship is his hobbies and interests. So that one's really cool. Like I said, this one's going in my personal collection. We each got one for our own personal collection. Um, the next one I thought was really cool. This one is the Joker and Harley Quinn. There's the military uniform. Some of these we will use in giveaways. And like I said, some of these we are keeping. And what's this one from? This one's also from Mr. Mendoza. Oh. U.S. Navy, orange, 10 years of service. So that's two that we got from him. Um, this one right here... And I'm sure you've seen me in videos on my hunt for the Cheshire Cat. Um, so we went ahead and grabbed this one, which I thought was really cool. And this one... Um, this one is from uh, Brandon M. Uh, in parentheses, it put lost to PTSD and suicide. Uh, served in the U.S. Marine Corps from San Diego, California. Served for eight years, hobbies and interests, making others happy. Yeah, it's so sad, you know, that um, we need to figure out something to do more for our military. I fully do believe that. Uh, this one is for his personal collection, and he chose um, the Halo one. Halo is one of my favorite video games of all time. And there's the uniform in the back, and it is Halo on the front. And this one's also from Mr. Mendoza from Orange County. Okay, or so from that's Orange. Three, three from him, right? Three from him, yeah. And, you know, we just randomly picked out the bracelets. Um, we did not look at, you know, which one belonged to which. This one was a Deadpool one, and obviously... Uh, He's a Deadpool fan, so we went ahead and grabbed a Deadpool one. This one's really cool. And this one's from Army, Shla uh, Army slash National Guard, Mr. Suinter, Adam Levine's cousin. <laughs> and if you all know who Adam Levine is, he's from Maroon 5. Um, he's not the one that has moves like Jagger. Uh, served in the U.S. Army for this particular uniform. Uh, from Palmetto, Georgia. 17 wow, years. 17 years. And hobbies and interests is helping veterans. And then... That's a cool one. That is a very cool one. This is the last one. This one was actually bought as a gift for somebody. So, like I said, I'm sure they will know who the gift is for once they see it. But this one is the Flash. And there's the military uniform. And it's funny because this was the seventh one we bought. Because I was like, oh, there's no Flash. And we kept looking and looking. So we bought our six. And right before we were leaving, I just happened to look down the, at the table. And there was a stack of these. And I said, oh, I need one more. And this one's from Mr. Stanton. U.S. Air Force, 
Lowville, New York. Served for five years. Hobbies and interests are painting and drawing. So we went ahead, like I said, and we grabbed um, seven bands. And you've seen the pops that we got. We had a great time. We will be going back. Um, I will put the link to the store and to Nick's um, Instagram down below. If you're in Southern California, you should go by and check it out. Um, do make sure you check the hours because I know he has different hours each month, he said. Um, like tonight they're open, but they're not open for sale. Tonight they're just passing out candy. Um, well... By the time you see this video, Halloween will be over. But Yeah, and he says he gets a lot of people for Halloween. Yeah, he I don't know. I think he said last year they spent six, seven hundred dollars on candy. Seven hundred dollars in candy and it was and gone ran in out. Two <laughs> hours it was gone. Yeah. And, and he said one. one. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty funny. So they're pretty packed. Um but like I said, they do wonderful, wonderful things. So uh please check it out. Um check out the you know his website check him out on instagram um it's a great place and if you live in southern california swing by and check it out you know we did we yeah. we did per the recommendation of michael and faith over at pops with purpose and we had a blast we did we had it was really nice to go meet him it was really fun to get to open the mystery bags right there in the store and see what you got and um it was kind of a challenge to pick out pops you know, because they were like, which one we do we want? You know, it's kind of hard to make decisions um, because there are so many. He has a lot of pops in that store, too. Yeah, you can see that in the uh, video clips. Yeah, and you'll see the video clips throughout this video um, in between us talking. And um, we're going to go ahead and cut um, a lot of that video into this video so you guys can see everything. Um but again, we just kind of wanted to show you our little field trip because we don't normally take field trips like this um, that are Funko related. Um, we will do field trips down the road. We'll do another one for this, obviously. And we will definitely be going to Hollywood for when the new Funko store opens. Probably not right away because I don't like a lot of people. Um, <laughs> large sure. crowds. I, I, I don't deal well with large crowds. Um, and waiting in line when it's not that far and we can just wait a little bit longer and then go. <laughs> yeah. You know, so, um, we will definitely check that out. And when we do, we'll take you guys along with us and we'll let you see what the Funko store in Hollywood looks like. I'm sure someone will probably beat us to that again because we won't be down there the day that it opens. Yeah. Um, you know, plus with work and everything, it doesn't always work out too well. So, um, again... We hope you guys enjoyed this. We hope you enjoyed everything we've shown you. Um, we will use some of these, I'm sure, in our giveaways. Like I said, we will use some of these in giveaways. So what we decided we're going to do right now is we're going to take the four that are right here. We're going to throw them in. I'm going to throw them into this bag. And Spectre here is going to draw one out. And all you have to do is comment down below hashtag band for arms and we will on the 18th when we do our 300 subscriber giveaway we will do a random comment picker we're going to draw right now and see what bands are going to win so not that i think this will mix them up very much but i'm not going to let specter peek just reach in grab one All right, which one are we and giving away? it's the Batman oh, one. Oh, it's the Batman one. Okay, so all you have to do is hashtag down below, um, hashtag band for arms. It will be listed below. And, um, yep, that's it, band for arms. Um, and you will win this Batman bands for arms because, like I said, we will be going back. So, um, and I think these are awesome 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 and they support our troops and that is wonderful so we are going to give away something besides a funko pop <laughs> or something funko related yeah <laughs> so uh but yes please please comment down below with the hashtag tell us what you thought of the place tell us if you're thinking about visiting it we want to know um and again on the 18th when we choose our 300 subscriber winner we will choose the winner of this batman uh band okay yep all right, so we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.
Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell. So we're going to do our giveaway on the 18th, correct? Yeah. What are you doing? Make a phone here. Why? I don't need no. Hold on. We have to hold that. Shut up. Okay, so.